Now let's take a look at the video for Aquatic Systems Overview. Fish, bugs, turtles, birds, and plants. Aquatic ecosystems are teeming with life. There are actually six major aquatic ecosystems in Texas, providing us with a diversity of biological life. Aquifers and springs contain and channel groundwater. Underground reservoirs and rivers form the aquifers, while springs are the points where groundwater travels to the surface. Rivers and streams are flowing water with a measurable current. They also contain fish, attract wildlife, and carry fresh water to the ocean. Lakes and ponds are bodies of standing water, many of which have been built by placing dams across rivers or streams. They are used to hold water for people to drink, production of electric power, recreation, and for use in agriculture. Wetlands are the places where water meets land and are among the most productive ecosystems in the world. A majority of Texas's saltwater and freshwater fish species depend on wetlands for food, spawning, and aquatic nurseries for their young. Bays and estuaries hold a dynamic mix of freshwater and saltwater that supports 90% of the commercial and recreational fish and shellfish in the Gulf of Mexico. And the Gulf of Mexico is the ninth largest body of water in the world providing over 1.5 billion pounds of food collected by commercial fisheries every year. Protecting and restoring Texas aquatic habitats helps maintain biodiversity, which is good for fish, birds, bugs, plants, and people.